I know that puppy, that's uh, Zoe. Yeah, what's the owner's name? Remember Danny. Name? What is it? Danny. That's it. Nice enough guy. He is, he's got a lot of potential if he quit drinking. He's got a lot of potential, he's a good, good, good guy. When we were playing at Cheers in the winter time there, the, he had showed up and had asked him to leave because I guess there was a problem with him the last time he was in before. Oh so uh, yeah, he tends to I'm get not little, sure what happens. He gets aggressive and stuff when he drinks, right? Like not <coughs> violent, like he never gets to that yeah. point, but he just gets kind of... There's another... If it's a type of alcohol he drinks, it makes him like that. Yeah, when he's sober, great guy. But drunk. <coughs> You're right, if he can get off the booze, he might get off the streets too. <coughs> <coughs> it's hard though. I've been on the streets too. I know what it's like. What do you think? This is good. Nice yeah. Nice taste, eh? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe I'll go grab my coffee. <coughs> No, no, go ahead, smoke it, guys. Hi Zoe. Hi Zoe. Here, buddy. Hi, baby. You're so good. I hear you. I hear you. See you soon. I love you too, Zoe.
He's got all his stuff over the table. He's laying there, like, all his crap on this table. Earlier, I thought the dog was inside the bar. Because it was at the window barking, and then it kind of walked away behind. It must have went behind the bike or oh, whatever. Oh, like, so you couldn't see it. And it looked like it went into the into the store, like into the dark. That's funny. <sighs> what are you smoking these days, doing? Uh. Thanks. Canadians. Canadians. Uh, I've been buying cartons lately. Right on. Did your friends still go to the uh, reserve? Yeah, 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 yeah. <coughs> 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 the new pot crops are coming in, so I'm going to like, yeah. <coughs> <coughs> this last couple, of, <coughs> last month or so has been slow on pots growing, huh? There's a place near my place uh, called True North that's got uh, yeah. really good prices. I've heard of that. They're, they're a little bit cheaper than everywhere else I find, but, you know. I've heard good ones. I just always go in and say, I want like 20 of your pre-rolls. Uh, this is what, how much I want to spend. And they, they, I recommend this one sells all the time. Yeah. It's always good. I, with Garden City, I'm the same way. Or whatever they recommend usually yeah, is, right? Yeah, it's usually pretty good. Yeah. So Some people... North, it's right on, uh, I fuck, I think it's, uh, right. Walk around or fuck, is it Steel Street or something like that, or Iron Street, one of those two? Yeah. Is it the street that the bar's on? Um, or not Park, another, no. If you're walking down this, if you're walking down Broadway and you cross the bridge and now you're on Ontario, you're walking towards King Street, the last street just before King Street, that's where it is. You turn left and it's down on the left-hand side. Okay, I think I know you're talking about. You can see it from, if, like, you, if you look down, like, look, you'll see it. Like, they usually have these great big flags that says now open and... So the street before little. you get to King Street, yes. you just turn... I don't remember back. what it is, though. I think it's steel. I want to say steel. Mm -hmm. huh. But I'm not 100% sure. And it's like a bike ride, like a five-minute bike ride for me or a 20-minute walk. No, no problem. I like to get out and walk and ride my bike once in a while. It's good for you. Like yeah, if it wasn't so if it wasn't for me cookies. delivering if it wasn't for me delivering flyers or the Michelle on Thursday, I'd get no exercise at all. Okay. I like being at home. I like doing stuff around the house and hanging out and all that stuff. It's nice to get out too. And just, you know. Well, I'm just always <laughs> riding. Yeah, I, know I don't what walk you mean, yeah. anymore hardly, yeah. right? So besides um, Michelle's helping her on Thursdays. <coughs> <coughs> Check out uh, Jesse Wells. He's this young guitar player, but he's got an older voice. Oh, and yeah. It's a very folk, folksy voice. Nice. But he does these short two, three minute guitar songs about certain things. Yeah, right on. Yeah, but he's really, really good. Jesse Wells? Jesse Wells, W E L L E S. Oh, and yeah. he, plays, <laughs> he plays harmonica too on some of the songs. He's got a harmonica set up. It's kind of so good. Nice. Yeah, he's really good. But the songs he sings are hilarious. Like they're. They're, they're these kind that, that would get people pissed because it's the truth, right? Like yeah. he sings this one about it's your own damn fault, <laughs> you're so damn fat. <laughs> and it's all about the excuse of people getting and stuff. Yeah. He does this other one about fentanyl, does one about Walmart. <laughs> yeah, all the That'd people show where there's a Walmart. He's a cigarette. He's a kid chewing a cigarette butt on a stack of fucking Kool-Aid and shit. Yeah.
Company. Yeah. I got cat hair all over it. And cat <laughs> keeps going up. <coughs> I got my second batch of merch coming in today. I got hats made. I got 24 iron bar hoodies made and another 50 shirts. No, all these are just being given away. Just uh, first, it's just for promotional, right? I get to write it out for my taxes, so I get a bit of that back. And it gets my name out there. Half a pill in her midnight snack. No. She'll sleep all through the night, won't notice you sleeping, she'll feel much better rested. That's <laughs> her value. Just a half a value. Yesterday, I'm, I go in to change Tammy, and Lil Razzie's at the bottom of the bed, and I gotta move him because she has to stretch out, right? So I went over and I scooped my hand under his front all the way to the back, grabbed around the back, and lifted him up, and took him over to the other bed and <laughs> gently put him down. And then he pretended he was all getting all settled down. And then when I let go, he jumps up and runs back to the bottom of the bed and he kiss settles back down on the in his spot. Yeah. But when I brought the plastic I need a plastic bag. And he runs off. I should have done that in the first place. Something burning? A cigarette, maybe? No, like wood. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, probably, yeah, yeah. Pretty sure they cleared it all out. Yeah, I seen them the other day with the. Remember they were cutting all the brush and everything. Uh, That's so the cops don't have to go down there. They can just look down the hill. <coughs> so brush doesn't. I know that down uh, like between the train bridge and the docks on Lincoln Street by the canal, there's a couple people out there in tents and they have fires there. They do campfires right by the canal. I've seen that. They got a gazebo set up. One of the tents is like an open-sided gazebo. And then the, the other tent, tent has like a barbecue out. Like it looks like a permanent barbecue. They, they've driven in and they got it sitting there. Yeah. on and the dog jumped at the guy up onto the one woman that was trying to go by and they we were just like going like this walking by and the guy was just kept walking didn't care the dog was just <laughs> <laughs> I mean the dog had a muzzle on so it couldn't bite but <laughs> These new lids, you can actually close them when you're like riding, for example. Mm -hmm.
I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching. It was kind of a uh, different perspective of uh, view for you guys. Um, I wasn't wearing uh, a vest this morning for filming. So uh, you guys got stuck down there. I apologize if it uh, wasn't like the usual. But that's the way it is. I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Coffee Club.